Last week, we worked on contour lines, lines that followed the curve of an original line. Now we're going to talk about concentric shapes. A concentric shape is a shape that fits inside an original shape. Flip your practice paper, that folded paper that we used last time, over to the back. You can turn your paper any way you want, and you can use any sort of drawing material today. You'll probably see concentric circles most often. They're circles that fit inside of circles, following that same principle that we used with contour lines, where the second and third lines stay the same distance away from the line before them. Other shapes can be concentric too, like squares and triangles. Concentrate on keeping your lines the same distance from each other. This will mean you'll need to go really slow as you work. Now try an irregular shape, a shape with an odd or strange outline. Notice how I had to break off my line and do separate shapes when my openings got too small. Now try a shape that overlaps with your other shapes. Remember, when your line bumps into another shape, you need to stop drawing. Try another irregular shape that overlaps one of your original shapes.
keep going and fill your paper with concentric shapes of any kind. You might even try a letter. Try some big shapes. And try some small shapes. 